is a small town in the northeastern Free State, only 280 kilometers from Johannesburg, roughly between Folksrust and Newcastle. Sikui Flay Nature Reserve is situated between the municipal grounds of Miamal and 12 neighboring commercial farmers. The 30 kilometers of jeep track roads through the reserve of 4,500 hectares will take less than four hours to cover. Vehicles with good ground clearance should not experience problems during dry periods. During the rainy season in the summer months, many of the roads will be flooded and inaccessible. Parts of the numerous oxbow lakes can be seen here. This marshland is a very important sponge area for the Vaal River catchment area. The Clip River, which is a reliable tributary of the Vaal River and eventually the Vaal Dam, which provides Kauteng with water, originates at Normandins Pass, about 40 kilometers south of Sikui Flay. It runs through this floodplain, which has a total of 12,000 hectares. The wetland received its Ramsar status of international importance on 21st of January 1997, with an average rainfall between 800 and 1200 millimetres per year, mainly in summer, it is no surprise that this is the largest wetland on the high felt. Being part of the high felt grassland biome, it's not surprising that 27 different grass species and an even bigger variety of plant species, including wild rice, occur in the reserve. Nature lovers and bird watchers from far away are attracted to the more than 230 bird species. There are three bird hides well situated in the reserve. Endangered species such as the wattle, crowned and blue cranes, as well as the whiskered terns, breed here. The name Sikoi Flay, which is Afrikaans for hippo wetland, is not misleading. We saw several hippos basking in the winter sun outside of some of the deeper channels. You can also expect to see black wildebeest, red hartebeest, roan, zebras and buffalo. Due to the presence of dangerous animals, the only activities allowed inside Sikui Flay Nature Reserve are self-drive game viewing and bird watching. This prefabricated house is used by visiting scientists who overnight in the reserve. Brand new accommodation options in the reserve include eight four-bed chalets, as well as a campsite with six stands. These facilities were not operational yet at the time of our visit. Interesting historical facts of Miamal include the fable of the 12-year-old Rachel Ki de Beer. She protected her six-year-old brother from the cold and died in the process on the farm where the nature reserve is today. Mahem Guest House offers first-class accommodation in the small town of Miamal with its limited options.